guys. Swarm in now. Hey guys, old angry gamer coming at you. My game wrecker this week, Herm the Worm. Where are you? Because you really pissed me off. I think you made my sister and my brother in law mad also. Herm went 45 and 9, which is pretty impressive. That's like almost five kills a minute. I have not done that yet. And there's little Herm's avatar, and I wish I had a button sometimes when I'm playing these games that I could just make that happen because that would make me feel so good deep down inside. I would love it. What I did was I went through all of Herm's kills and I clipped them so if you see this uh, jumping around it's just going from kill to kill to kill you know some of the clips are a little bit longer because he gets three or four kills in a matter of you know 20 seconds or something but basically that's all I did now as you can see I used my Call of Duty Elite and I went into the Herm the Worms Herm the Worms uh, Elite account and I checked him out look at that a kill death ratio of 2.96 win percentage 87 percent and and score per minute pretty impressive 533 beast so i'm up on my elite account i'm checking out herm the worm just because he pissed me off he did really well he destroyed us there's no question about it and anyway i was expecting to find some magic setup or some magic guns or something but there was none of that there and uh no i'm not a stalker just because you check out somebody's elite account doesn't make you a stalker but it's a good tool to have because when you're playing that game and you come up against somebody and they're like destroying you and no matter what you do you can't get ahead you want to know what's going on so at the very least you get into their elite account you check it out there's no magic there everything was equal you just were outgunned or outgamed or outplayed end of story anyway i have to mention uh, me and my brother-in-law before we played on sunday we went to a little private session, played some bots, warmed up. I monkeyed around with a lot of different setups. I really didn't find anything that helped me out, as you can see. I didn't do very well in this game. I think I went 11 and 12 or something like that. I don't know. I don't remember. I put all the bad games out of my mind. I don't want to think about them. I do not want to think about any negativity that stems from Call of Duty Black Ops 2. It's not healthy. Uh, back to Herm the Worm. I also, well, I was stalking him on his elite account, noticed that he belonged to a clan. And there you go. The A-X-O-N clan, or Axon. I don't really know what it means. There's 95 members. I'm sure that everybody else in his clan is just as good as him and just as irritating. I am not a clan member. I mean, we do have one, but it's just for fun. We don't take it seriously. We don't do any league play. It's just a silly kind of shenanigan type clan. I don't know why I like to use accents, sometimes it just hits me that way. But anyway, back to the game. I guess that uh, Herm the Worm deserves his little moment in the spotlight. Not a huge spotlight, just my own little secret spotlight of irritating moments in my Call of Duty Black Ops 2 career. And while I'm on the subject of spotlights, I want to say thank you to a couple of people. Uh, X Rumley, I watch your videos and I really enjoy them. And uh, in the morning when I'm getting ready to go to work, I have that song playing with your video, your newest video. So thank you. And also uh, the Doc87. I really look forward to his videos. I wish he could put out about two or three a day because uh, I find them interesting, helpful, and useful. So thank you goes out to X Rumley and the Doc87. I think X Rumley was one of my first subscribers and he's been with me since uh, the beginning which has only been about a month and a week. And uh, on that note, I guess I'm out of here and as you guys all know, I got to go. Peace.